In this quick lesson, I'm just going to show you how to select and use these palette tools in the Design Center. As you can see in this list here, we have our default color palette. And this could represent spot colors, vinyl colors, colors that you've made up, colors you've printed out, etc. Uh, to select these colors, you can come up to this uh, button here and click this. That loads up the color libraries and that has a large selection of all the color palettes as you can see here. And if you wanted to say select a particular uh, brand of vinyl that you've got in stock for example that you're going to cut out, you can come down here and select the brand, make sure you select the correct color palette that you're working with, in this case say these translucent films here, and you can see them load in here. So I can then as per usual just select colors within the job that I'm working on, it tells me obviously what palette I've got selected, and I can actually select these colors and apply those to my work as I go and that way I know exactly what colors I've used in my particular job that I might have in stock. So that's the color palettes. And if I want to go back and change it I can click on this button here and I can go back to say our default list that we had before and you can see that list there. Now if I wanted to select a color in this list I could click this choose button here and type in the code and that'll take me directly to that color in the list like so and again I could apply that to say this blue panel here. Just click apply and that becomes that color. So that's a good way of uh, selecting spot colors for example. Other uh, options here are the color matcher. This is used in the RIP. This is designed to target a particular color so that you can uh, reproduce it faithfully uh, when you're using the RIP in Vinyl Master uh, and you can slide those back and forward. Now the other thing you can do is uh, print out a chart. So you can load in a chart and actually print it out and you can see it loads directly in the RIP manager and there's the chart there. We could then now go ahead and rip that out and we would know what those colors print like and show our customers for example. So that's how the color palettes work in the, um, in the design center here and it's a great way of working with spot colors and vinyl color charts uh, with the work you've got. That's the end of this lesson.